Hello everyone, it's Lorraine and today I'm back to you with a, another haul. I went back to one of my favorite places to go while I'm down here in Atlanta and it is um, Chapel's Chapel Beauty. It's at 8140 Mall Parkway at Stonecrest Mall. So um, it is where I originally found the Nana Coco polishes. And unfortunately, they didn't have anything but the HD crystal set, which is what I originally purchased and already have. So I didn't pick up any um, new Nana Coco polishes, but I did pick up some other ones. And um, I also picked up a couple like pieces of jewelry. I like like the chunky rings and things like that. So let me, I'll do that first since it's it's the least of what I got and I'm not sure the exact prices but the jewelry ranged from like $5.99, $5.99 to like looks like $10.49 yeah $5.99 to $10.49 so first one I'm actually wearing it is this like studded spiky um, ring they are all the stretchy ones just because I generally have difficulty finding rings that um, fit me so this is the one it has some basic silver ones then smaller silver studs and then kind of silver studs with the um, rhinestones in them so this is the first one and um, the next one that I have is um, just a really nice, pretty, chunky, um, and this one's just a chunky orange one, and it has like some little detailing here. It is another stretchy ring. All of them are stretchy. It just has the same detailing across the back. And that orange, I should have kept that window, the curtain closed, and then the next one I got is, um, I got two of these. These are fairly different and um, I'm not sure how easy these are gonna be to actually wear because of how they are. So there's two separate rings and it's got this really cute like curved pattern and then it has these um, spikes dangling from chains from them. So you place your two fingers in here and then you'd have these kind of dangling. I don't know, these might get in kind of in the way. So, I don't know. Or I guess maybe you would put them on, I don't know if you wear them, so that the spikes hang down this way. I don't know, we'll see. So, I got two of these, one in kind of like a kind of silver one and one in kind of a brighter over one here so you can see and this one has the darker color chains while this one has the silver chains here so this one has like black chains this one has the silver chain so same rings same idea just slightly different with the spikes <clears throat> and then I got this one here, very pretty blue, I couldn't pass that up. And it's just a lighter silver plated ring with the bright blue rhinestones. And also it has like black at the base and then silver, like it's not rhinestones, but just the material of the ring, like little dots and then this brass colored looking one which looks like that and it's got like a like yellowy yellowish colored rhinestones here in the middle and it's kind of like a leaf or filigree type pattern I believe very cute and then the last one I got is this one here and I like that it has this very different with a little chain detailing there. So that's what that one looks like. So that is all of the jewelry pieces that I got, I believe. And so on to the actual nail polishes. 
I think I need to close this curtain back. Okay, so this first polish that I got is by Nika K. I have seen their makeup at the beauty supply stores in Ohio, but I have not seen any of their nail polishes. And this is a very pretty, like, um, more, it's more magenta. It's showing up kind of purple, but it's a nice deep magenta with like some purple undertones. It's like a shimmery metallic-y formula. And I really like the bottle, although it's an in, impractical bottle for storage. But it looks like a pretty decent formula. It looks like it's got a decent size brush. I haven't tested these out and the smell is not sh as strong as most polishes are and then i got another one by nika k i'm sorry i didn't tell you the name of that one this one is called um why don't places have names why did there's no name for this polish it's not one that i can readily see in the um yeah so if i find the name i will try to remember to put it in the description bar because the discount just doesn't say what name it is so this next one is um, NY number 127 and that is NY number 111. So this one's 127. It's kind of like a jade green with some blue on blue and purple undertones of the, in the shimmer. So this is that color and this is just what the label looks like. So the next ones they had china glaze for $2.99 and nika k were $2.99 as well and um these are some older ones but i didn't have these this is like a coppery metallic kind of and this one's called poetic again china glaze $2.99 I got another kind of metallic one. This is a kind of pinky colored metallic. And this one is called Emotion. And then the last one that I got is called Blue Sparrow Neon. Honestly, I think I may have this one now that I think about it. I think I have this one. It's very pretty blue. And um, this is a neon, and it is called Blue Sparrow. But very pretty. And then they had another one that didn't have a name on it at all. And so the next ones I picked up were some clean colors. The clean colors were all 99 cents. And I pretty much just picked out um, the hollow holographic ones, or those with holographic quality. So this is a blue... Um, tinted like glitter very fine glitter with holographic glitter in it it says it's hollow chrome but i have another one that's just like this but it's got purple and it's named exactly the same so um i don't know which what the names are this is the purplish one and this is the blue they're both basically the same they just have um ones in a purplish base and ones more blue and they're both very very fine fine this one needs a serious shaking i need one of those bottle shakers so this one is a they're both very fine glitters both holographic 99 cents the next is like a blackish gold with holographic bar glitter or tinsel called moon dance and some of these, I can't remember if I already have these or not, but there we go. This next one is not a hollow, but like a navy blue with some purple. This one's called Midnight Queen.
And this next one is silver with some chunky holographic hex glitters called Bridal Shower. And this one's very pretty. It needs a sh serious shaking, but and so you can't really see the hollow that well. There you go. This next one is suspended in a very murky, it looks like a brownish base, but it's got some multicolored like turquoise fine glitter and then some larger silver pink and what looks like yellow um, glitter. And this one is called City Never Sleeps. And then this next one is a very pretty like period dough green with some finer holographic glitter and, and some holographic tinsel. And this one is called Starry Meteor. And then the last clean color that I picked up is, it's a pink, just like Starry Meteor, but it's just a little like a pinkish purple with more holographic bar glitters. And this one is called Starry Night. Very, very pretty. And then the next colors that I got were by LA Girl. And I had seen these a while ago mentioned um, about them having a holographic collection um, at Rite Aid, of course. But this was a while ago and I never ever found them or saw anyone else mention them. And then they also had some texture polish and some other ones. So I'll show you the two like feather. These are called Feather Frenzy. And again, these are by LA Girl, and the LA Girls were $3.99, although some of them were $2.99. I'm not sure which ones were $2.99. I'm assuming it's the Feather Frenzy and the Glad this one's called Splatter. So this is the first Feather Frenzy. It is like tinsel, and it is very pretty, vibrant blue, white, and I think there's some silver in it. It's like the Sally Hansen's or the um, China Glaze from the Horizon collection. They had some um, textured ones or feathered or whatever they call it. And this one is called Peacock. This next one is an orange and white with some silver, also from the Feather Frenzy line. And this one is called Oriole. And then the next is a glitter, and this one is called Splatter, also by LA Girls. And it is like a very pretty like Tiffany green, Tiffany blue green, it's again called Splatter. And it's just, the name is Splash. It's from the Splatter collection. It did have more colors, but some of these looked much like the Nana Coco ones that um, I have picked up. So it's got the greenish turquoise and white and then very fine white glitters in there. So. The rest that I got, I believe, are $3.99, and they're from the LA Girl 3D FX Hologram Nail Polish, so holographic. This one's called Electric Cor Coral. Very, very pretty. Can't wait to try these out. I am a sucker for um, holographic nail polish, and again, this is called Electric Cor Coral. Very pretty.
this next one is probably my favorite. All of these are from the 3D effects. And this one is called Brilliant Blue. And it is just very, very gorgeous. And the holographic glitter is very, very fine. Actually, there's another one that that's, the two blues are probably going to be my favorites. This one is called Teal Dimension. Very, very pretty. It looks much the same, but next to each other you can see the difference. Um, maybe not. This one is a much deeper, and this is a more turquoisey teal color. So, Teal Dimensions. This next one is kind of a, a pinkish color called Dazzling. The name is up here, Dazzling Pink. So there were two, four, six, eight from the Holographic Collection. This is their silver, and this is called 3D Silver. Very, very pretty. This next one is like a magenta type pink, and it's called Purple Effect. It's more magenta than purple. It's like a deep magenta purple. This one's very gorgeous as well. It reminds me of Miss Congeniality by Orly. And then this next one is a red called Sparkle Ruby. Very, very pretty. Name is on top. Very, very pretty red. I don't have any like true red holographics. And then this next one is their black. And this one is called Black Illusion. And this is very, very gorgeous. They're all very gorgeous, and I can't wait to try them out. So that is everything that I got from Chapel Beauty. Um, again, it is located at Stonecrest Mall. The um, LA Colors 3D effect were $3.99. The other three, the Feather Frenzy and the Splatter, were $2.99. The Nika K's were um, $2.99, the clean color were $0.99, cents, and then the China Glaze were only $2.99. So that is everything. Let me know if you've tried any of these. Thank you for watching. Stay polished at all times, and have a great day. Bye.